And God is available 24 hours a day. I like that. It means that the kingdom is available 24 hours a day. And because you are busy, you are caught in our attempt to run and get what we think we don't have. That is why we have never had access to the kingdom. Imagine a wave running, a wave running, searching for water. It's very funny. Because the wave is water. And that is what we are doing. Whether we are in Buddhism, or Christianity, or Islam, we are doing very much the same thing. We are running. We are searching for God, for the kingdom of God, for the ultimate, for Nirvana, for the pure land. We have been learning about the teacher Lin Chi. Because most of us belong to the lineage of Master Lin Chi. And we hear him saying always that what you are looking for, you have to, to destroy them all, to throw them away. You have to go home to yourself. You have to know that what you are looking for is already there in yourself. God, His kingdom, solidity, freedom, (coughs) immortality, everything is available in the here and the now. And believe me, this is not a difficult, uh, a difficult exercise. It's not a difficult homework. It's very delightful. And every minute of it will have the power of healing and transforming. transforming. That is the practice of walking in the kingdom of God. Suppose you have a plane ticket to go to the kingdom of God. Suppose you have sat in the plane for a long time, now it has landed in the kingdom. (coughs) And when you touch the kingdom of God, do you think you have to run anymore? You don't have to run anymore. And I doubt that when you arrive in the kingdom of God, you can enjoy the kingdom of God. Because you are used to run. And when you arrive in the kingdom of God, you continue to run. You cannot enjoy the kingdom of God. And that is not the kingdom of God. It's no longer the kingdom of God. Even if you have spent a lot of time sitting on the plane, So if the kingdom of God is available to you or not, and that is up to you, you have to make yourself available to the kingdom. Walking in the kingdom of God, you don't have to be formal. 
You don't have to be formal. You can adopt any style of, of walking that bring you the, <coughs> the deepest kind of joy, the deepest kind of happiness possible. You don't have to show anyone that you are practicing. You practice the non-practice, the practice of non-practice. And when you see something interesting, you can kneel down, and you can look, and you can smile. And you continue the practice of breathing in, the practice of breathing out mindfully, so that so that you can stay. in the here and the now, in a solid way. You get in touch with the here and the now, not only with your feet, but with your eyes, with your hand, with your mind, your nose, your tongue. Six sense organs can can come together and touch the here and the now. Eyes, nose, tongue, ear, body, and mind. In touch with uh, <coughs> form, sound, perfume, odor, touch and perceptions. Be alone. Be in solitude. That is the only way for you to touch it deeply. If you are with someone talking, you cannot do that. So you have, you begin with being alone, enjoy deeply, and I am confident there are those of you who can succeed right in the first attempt. And I assure you that every step like that help you to heal physically and mentally. Because healing will not be possible with your body coming to a stop, with your mind coming to a stop. Because if your body and your mind continue to be under pressure, (coughs) under tension, healing is difficult. The moment when you are able to stop physically and mentally, your body and your mind develop capacity of self-healing. And if you you can practice like that, for a few days, you notice the change within your body and in your mind. Because we might have a physical illness, we might have mental illness. That when, only when we have come to a stop, that the body and the mind will have will rediscover, will uh, recover their capacity of self-healing because our body can heal itself. Our mind can heal itself. Remember when you cut your finger? You don't have to worry. You only have to clean the wound. And your body knows how to mend the cut. You don't have to do anything. So, so the body has the capacity of, self, of healing itself. But you have to allow it to do so. You have to authorize our body 
투힘했어요. 